Big plans for today. Oh, yes. This is going to be an exciting day in our beaver. Starting out with two beautiful espressos and all the makings of a really good smoothie. Today's change is to go for a run here on the beautiful island by Ibiza. We are going to try and run to the top of one of the local little hills around here. Uh, Ibiza is not exactly famous for being flat. It's very hilly and very cragged. So whenever you go for a run, you're either running up or you're running down. There's not an awful lot of opportunity for, for calm, flat uh, running here. Three miles uphill till we get to the end of this point. You ready to go running? I am ready to go running. You gonna run like that? My innocence How it always seems to get lost In violence We always seem to get caught It's no coincidence That we're running from the past Forgiveness wasn't something that we had Limitless We're living limitless I think it's time on this beautiful sunny day to try out our stand up pedal board, which is right over there. Don't forget you got sunglasses on. Oh, yeah. Sunglasses. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Tasha showing us how he's done ladylike. A little chillier than I expected. That's why the first thing you do is get in the water, be done with it. Right, my first bit of advice yeah. is get away from the dinghy and then just, I'll show you a couple of little uh, tricks. Okay. Right, go left, right, try and see how stable it is. Okay. No, more, more, more. Stay, see how stable, see, really rock it. Keep going, really rock it. What did you 
like about it? We have our running shoes to explore on land. And now we've got the stuff to explore on the water. I'm preoccupied with trying to figure out how to fix my... Can you just focus for a second? Yeah. Do you feel like a zen-like state coming over you and at one with the water? I found it really fun. Could you compare for me uh, paddleboarding with meditation? No. Am, am I meant to meditate? I hate yoga. How about yoga on a paddleboard? Hmm. How about the downward dog? There you go. <laughs> get here much quicker this time. Remember the time we used to live in the sand. I was yours and you were mine. So it lasts until the end. Until the end. Tell me about your two types of beaches. There's two types of good beaches. There's the big open wide space beach. I think like Copacabana in Rio, with loads of people running around, many generations hanging out, a lot of sport, volleyball, football, frisbee, everything going on. It's like a big community of things. Or like this. Small, cute coat. No sport, no many generations, just chill people. Two types of good beaches. I have here the rope, towing rope, that's going to go with our wakeboard. And we're going to tow Tasha at horrendous speeds behind the wakeboard. Because that sounds jolly good fun. That should do it, right? And I tie these two to the boat. This thing comes with a picture showing the different levels of difficulty from one laying down to two kneeling, three is, I don't know, oh three is kneeling advanced, four is standing straight, five is standing sideways, and six is just plain surfing without any rope. <laughs> did not know about on Cheeky Monkey. We have an outdoor shower with warm water. It's pretty nice, huh? Oh yeah, this is great. Mm. Whose great idea was that? I'm on. Just wrap it around the It's still open. Yay! I left the flashlight in the car, is that okay? I mean, <laughs> in the dinghy. <laughs> okay.
take them. We'll take the necklace and the okay. earrings. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Very, very beautiful. And if you feel much, much strong, very strong and cannot sleep, then you take it out. Is that right? Okay. okay. <laughs> it's going to make you strong? Apparently so. Oh, good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Ryan's just informed me that we might not have enough gas to get home. Is that true? <laughs> we should probably check before we leave. It has to be said. But we're on a good side. My wife is a rower. So if we do run out of gas, it doesn't really matter because my wife will run me home, which is kind of sweet. I will be the cops and I will be very vocal. <laughs> I love this little island because it's like all the best islands in the world. It ha it's full of people who have just come here from somewhere else to enjoy life. And I think my favorite places in the world have that in common. So this little island, especially this little beach, is kind of special. But tomorrow we're going to Barcelona, another place, another city, where people travel to from all over the world because Beautiful. It has great food, it's got great people, and you always have a good time in Barcelona. And any town that has a beach you can walk to from the city center is ace in my book. about your last night in Ibiza? Um, a little bit sad, it's been a great two weeks here. Um, very, very relaxing, very refreshing, very revitalizing, it's been great. Oh my God, look at that dog. Hi puppy. Oh. Hey. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Adios. Time to go home. Adios, Ibiza. 